All right, <clears throat> let's do this. Excuse me. Welcome back to my let's play of of uh, Saga Two, the remake for the DS, also known as Final Fantasy Legend Two. Oh, let me just back out of this. At last, we left. We're, we were heading to the next world, the fifth one, which is I suppose we know as Guardians World. I'm, I forget if it's termed the same in this one, but uh, just give me a second here. I gotta grab a link real quick and post it. Just post them to our Discord group here real quick. Alright, there we go. And let me just... Now, uh, compared to the the, the uh, <clears throat> Final Fantasy Legend Two version of this game, there's quite a bit more uh, area to this than there is. Not much, just a little bit more. Unfortunately, this world—I'm just gonna give a quick heads up. This world doesn't last. This is a, this is probably the absolute fastest of, of the worlds that you visit. And when, and yeah, you know, you'll see as we go. You'll see why. Oop, move that mouse out of the way. Also, this game I never really said this. So you can actually play this game fully by touch. Well, the DS touchscreen or by mouse if you are playing like that, like like I am. So, how do you move? Is you tap and drag, and it actually makes the character walk, kind of like a joystick. Fairly intuitive. I do give a res give respect to the them having multiple ways of playing it. Reminds me of that one where the uh, Super Nintendo, uh, the one-handed controller for RPGs. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Excuse me, I'm sorry. I couldn't find the mute button in time. I apologize. And now, one of the strangest questions I'll probably ever ever ask. <coughs> Excuse me. Does it, does, will a chainsaw work on ghosts? I mean, we all know it works on zombies. We all know it works on severed hands and apparently sharks. So does it work on ghosts? The answer is yes. You can use a chainsaw on a ghost. Uh, yeah. Right, the funny thing is, I didn't in the original Legend Two. I didn't use the chainsaw all that much. It. I just started using it whenever I started playing uh, this version because it. Well, it looks pretty cool. <laughs> and burn a little bit of. Energy to, or not energy, learn a little bit of, of uh, weapon usage to get a couple, a little more powerful, hopefully. While I finish uh, posting here and I'm, I'm streaming. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> So it goes Thundaga to... I prefer that. Yeah. Hey, it didn't go to Thundar. It went to Hell Thunder. I think that's a definite improvement. And there we go. We have our first female unit of the, in our group. A Medusa that can, that can dodge earthquakes. Which, earthquakes don't happen too, too often early on.
Okay, and on to the Guardian's Town. Alright, I'll start by doing the just the old side quests and stuff. Yeah, you can kind of tell that this is I mean, kind of a short area just because of the Atrasil leaf. Just because of the, um, oh, it's a gift. Just because of the world is literally this town and go back home. <laughs> That's about it. I mean, technically, we could always just go. I don't know. I guess, they must have the directions screwed up because that wasn't north. That was east. Glass gear. Glass gear. That's a gift I, am, I know who that's going to. Yep. And that's going to Utera. The robot muse. Let's just take a quick peek here. I highly doubt anything popped up here. Yeah, nothing did. Oh well. Oh, break clear. Yeah, might as well. Oh, speaking of which, let me switch my threads around a little bit. We have a lot of hatred going around over here. I mean, admittedly, I I actually kind of enjoy watching them fight because every time they bicker, it's actually a different, a little bit different than the last one. So, and I, I sound like a horrible person for that. Now we got some cash, so let's see about upgrading some gear first. Uh, the Jut. The Jut is a. Uh, I really never really understood how it worked. In the other, in the, in the original game, it was called the Sypha, and it looked kind of like it had a it had a uh, a hook on it. And the throwing coins, they're pretty much similar to Goemon's throwing coins. I really don't quite get it, but because the damage they did is kind of low, I, I don't really, I really never could figure it out. Because I mean, to me, you could take a a regular bow, and it would do more damage than this. So it, I never got the point of it. And of course, the break tome is just uh, a stone. Arquebus is the original musket, and everything else is pretty, pretty commonplace. Uh, the grenade is the up, uh, the upgraded version of the submachine gun. But submachine gun looks cooler. So, <laughs> no, just kidding. Uh, let me go ahead and upgrade that. And I'm gonna pick up a shock whip. Well, the, the the jut. I think it also gives some kind of a defense boost, but I don't remember off the top of my head. But I'm not gonna worry too too much about it. Oh, there's another tip here. You can go to the inn and before upgrading your equipment, but I'm not overly concerned about it, so I'm just gonna head and upgrade it here because I'm not really concerned about one. Oh, it's actually the same thing. I really thought it was higher. No, it is a little bit higher. It just have it doesn't have a, a, a it just doesn't have a strength boost for the robot. So, but anyway, I'm just gonna go ahead and upgrade him with grenades instead of a machine gun. I probably should have thought about giving him both, but eh. I think he's okay with what he's got. Yeah, I think he's okay. All right, let me just give the whip to. Uh, yeah, I'll just wait on and give him the whip. Actually, you know what? Yeah, I'll give him the whip now. There we go. 
and see if the laser sword is better than the... No, same thing. Okay, fair enough. Yeah, I, I the reason why I usually go through here with with multi, with more one human lately, I've been liking that, is because I do enjoy having the ability to put multiple equipment on multiple people, having to worry too much. Like for instance, that mithril bow has been that mithril bow has been sitting in my inventory since oh, for a while. I haven't even touched it, and I probably won't get to because the robot doesn't doesn't run out of equipment, and the monster doesn't have equipment at all, so. Let's see. Favors anything. Yeah, that's the only way you can tell that. Of The only way you can tell how to get in here is by going to the jukebox and playing a specific a specific uh, tune. That staff healing is also very good, but I'm not going to waste my money out right now because it has 15 uses. And guess what? I'm finally getting rid of my main character's crappy bronze armor he's had since the start of the game. Oh, actually, I'm going to give him the. I'm going to give my. I'm going to give my Lindsay. I'm going to tone down her uh, defense a little bit, but. At the same time, I'll increase his strength. So, yeah, strength of 59 is pretty good. Because now, now he has a full giant set. And let's just let's just ditch that. And everything else can stay. And it's just save time. We'll I'll wait on giving the gifts out to the goddesses right now. The muses, I mean. <laughs> Excuse me. I got some time before I that chainsaw. Oh, I'll just keep it. It's fine. Uh, Revenge blade I'll toss in there. I'm not sure when I'll use it. I, I know that one's a pretty good one because it doesn't usually run out of effectiveness. I don't, at least I don't think it does. A lot, but like I said, I can't remember. <laughs> okay, I say it. Oh, I didn't say it. I didn't actually sleep there. That would help. Oh, let me just do a quick check, make sure my volume... Okay, my voice is not too, too low. Alright, so let's turn... Let's go ahead and do what the guy said and turn on the hero's tune over here. Is that the jukebox? And if you just talk to the guy, all he'll do is just... No, not him, the... If you talk to the barkeeper, all he'll tell you to do for 100 caro is to uh, play the jukebox. It's that's literally it. I'll even I'll even do it just to show you. It's a waste of 100 caro, but whatever. Use the jukebox. That's all it says. And I hit too fast, and the message vanished. <laughs> nothing to see. Nothing to see here. Move along. Move along. Right, I'm going to hit the AC real quick and turn it on. I'll be right back. All right, I'm all right. Okay, sorry about the wait. Prison here. I this actually does differ a little bit from the original version of the story here. I mean, you still get put in jail. <laughs> There's a lot more subquests here.
So now all we do is we pretty much raid the base for uh, goodies. And we can't leave until uh, the captain says we can leave. Yeah, we can't leave right now, so... I forget, though. Can we actually find stuff right now, or do we have to wait? I forget. Yeah, Ashura, Venus, Apollo, and Odin. I'm trying to see if there's anything in here. Oh, okay. <clears throat> I think there's one room that has treasure in it, but I don't remember which one it is. Yeah, all the conversations here are the same from the original game, too. This was actually a shout-out to a couple of other things. Uh, for, for starters, number one, at the end of the game in Legend 2, uh, you're supposed to go after the Ark of the Covenant, which is kind of comical that they, they, they posted that he already found it here. So, And the Four Crystals is, of course, from Final the Final Fantasy series, which is kind of comical. And the Holy Grail, I forget if it's in any other game, well... Well, uh, any other game related over here. Yep, here it is. A special item storage, no entry. So we'll go there and grab our, our grab some stuff after we're done here. Hello, Hawk. I, I, we got some good news, though. We, at least we got we have the internet under control now. Yeah, so you have a free in here whenever you need it. Oh, this was also added in. He he wasn't here originally. If you missed, if you needed to use the shop for anything, you had to wait until after leaving this world completely. It was a nice. It was a nice thing that they they added in for just just in case. Yeah, we're not gonna do any fighting at at this moment. Oh, where is he? I was gonna go ahead and go grab the go grab the the captain to, to battle with us, but oh well. It's empty. Oh wait, wait, wait! I just forgot about something. Let's throw back on the. Yeah, it's pretty bad over here, too. It's pretty muggy over here. Yeah, we're good here. Relic, world, tree, leaf. Energy. If I remember correctly, what, what energy does... Is it has a you can use one of your map ability things and heal yourself, but it has a chance of failing or not doing or doing very very little. I think it has a chance of also uh, hurting you, if I remember correctly, as well. But I mean, if you're if you're kind of stuck and need a, and need a heal, <laughs> oh, that's our first muse help. Hmm, it's funny that she isn't helping. Oh yeah, that's right, because my character is using a, a chainsaw, so the chainsaw can't be comboed too. Well, also tomorrow the uh, internet company is supposed to be coming by, coming by with the uh, upgraded support technician. The superior support technician, as they called him. 
So here's hope we have something we have something good come come out of that. If that's the case, I can start streaming later later at night. Thunder. Let's get out of here. <laughs> shouldn't even shouldn't even have given him a freaking new music. It was just a peon. It's actually fairly unknown which of the gods sent their troops to come after come after uh, the Guardian's base. And now the dad gets to be on the, on the team. And he's actually pretty badass. He's not as badass as, as Mask is, but he's pretty badass. I don't think there's any point to these other rooms, but we'll go quickly ch check over here just in case. Yeah, it's just an enemy. It's just enemies now. Now we have to go use chainsaws and cute fairies. I apologize in advance. I am a horrible person. Ah, uh, Pennsylvania. I'm actually from Pennsylvania. I just live in I live down south now. I'm actually from Pittsburgh. I just got I, I got a job down here working doing graphic design and that's why I am living here. That was about 15 years ago though. No, 13, 13. I'm sorry, 13 years ago. Not fast enough. turns into a sequoia. It's a nice it's a nice booze, but I don't wanna miss having miss having a female. Oh well. <laughs> oh poor Navi. No, that's that wasn't Navi, that was an evil fairy. I actually don't mind Navi. I don't I don't have a huge hatred for her, so she can at least rest easy. I won't chainsaw her. Yeah, I'm. I am from Pittsburgh. I can talk like a pit. I, I can speak Pittsburghese, so. Oh, did I do something dumb again? Nope, I didn't. Oh, okay. From York. I actually haven't been very many places in Pennsylvania. It's been pretty much I've been to Pittsburgh and a couple of places my parents would go to to go shopping, like Reading, Pennsylvania, and we went to the Hershey's factory once. I mean, I've... And most of the time, we, we travel to Ohio. Because we have family over there. 
wake up every morning and worship the Penguins. Oh, I remember back in the day we used to, I used to, yeah. I used to be a big hockey fan back in the day. Okay, nothing else here. So we'll go ahead and leave the building. Mm, this is a hell of a group. Now the next world I want to say is Venus is the Venus world, but I forget if the, it's either Venus or, or or the race world. And spiral goes into Cracker. Yeah, ghosts and worms. And that doesn't change. Yeah, I'm, I'm still surprised that I can chainsaw a ghost. Oh, it actually does have a death ability on it. First time I've actually seen that thing even hit. But yes, Hawk, we're, uh, hope we are, we're a little under, more under control of our situation because it is now official that at 8.30, the internet just goes haywire. So at, before that, we're fine. Because it's, it's been literally every day doing this. Ah, oh, poor fairy. I think the yeah, flame is for the mushrooms. And the fairy missed targets her heal and heals a person who is already full. Yep, chainsaw the fairy. <laughs> oh, excuse me. You know what the kind of the cool part was in the other in the about Legend Two. Originally, the oh by the way, we can't enter we can't enter the other buildings anymore. They've been blocked off. Anyway, uh, the cool one of the cool things is the actual chainsaw animation looked kind of funny. Is that worth this is an enemy or oh he's another shopkeeper. Uh, the the chainsaw actually looked pretty pretty brutal because it actually would dig into the enemy into the sprite of the enemy. <laughs> Yeah, I'm not. Oh, one second. Oh, this is oh, this is one of those energy sp spots on the world. There we go. Oh, it failed. All right, so yeah, we have fourteen more tries. 
and you can see why this isn't a very effective thing, because you can just keep trying. Okay, what happens over here? I think these are commandos, I want to say. Yep, it's a commando. So we do it with how do we handle a commando? Theridian solves his problems with a chainsaw. It, you have to look it up. Hello, Swerve. Uh, today, today, uh, today's. Actually, well, today and most of yesterday, uh, yes, well, I mean, last stream has been Theridian solves his problems with a chainsaw in this game. Yeah, I think it's the the flying the, the Concords. They have uh, Malcolm. It's, the song is called Malcolm, and it's Malcolm solves his problems with the chainsaw. I highly recommend it. It's pretty funny. So this is technically World Six, but there's not much to it. Yeah, we'll go ahead and drop by. Oh, we don't need to drop by the. Uh, we don't need to drop by there right now. Yeah, this is it right here. It lets you go to a weapon shop, tool shop, or an inn as needed. But we'll go drop by the inn real quick and just heal up. Originally, it, in, if you if you held left or right as you traveled down the 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 uh, pillar of sky, it would let you uh, just go into the shop. You wouldn't have to like travel all this way. It's like this is a little bit extra just to make it interesting looking. Hey, where did I get a magnum from? Hmm, cool. That's actually a really powerful gun too. I'm gonna hand it to our robot, to our resident robot. <laughs> yeah, that gun is really good. It's not gonna look as cool as the rocket punch, but. I really don't need to go to every shop because there's there's nothing really much of interest. It's just the same stuff I think as in the uh, Guardians Town. So, but I'll just go there I guess to show it. Oh, it's called Restoration Town. Yeah, but it's literally the same stuff. So I have two. I'm gonna keep the other cure tone. That's actually pretty handy to have. I will ditch a high potion though in place of it. Because there's no, really no po point to, to having uh, potions now that I have a cure tome. Yeah, I'll just drop the tool shop real quick just to show what it looks like. And there's just all of them are just on little houses on islands. That's all it is. Uh, yeah, we don't want we don't want the Hermes sandals. I'm I'm, I'm happy with the uh, with the getta for my main uh, character. Let me see what's his speed currently. Yeah, he's got to be at 15, 25. I mean, he's fine. The robot would be the only one I'd want to give them to, and I think I have him with it. Uh, yeah, why not? The robot's too slow. I'll give, a pair, give him a pair of shoes. And it's the, this one. Doesn't give him any extra speed. Well, that sucks. Eh, oh well. 
make you fa make my main character faster. That's fine. So the get of the probably doesn't do. I could have sworn that it, that the that they actually did affect the robot, but I guess they changed it. All right, off we go. Do you have a satellite, Hawk? Well, I'm just checking real quick to see if I think this is this one's blocked off until we finish. Yep, it is. Okay. Yeah, so we're about done with this chapter. Yeah, this is a very short chapter. Now, I don't remember the name of this world, but I remember it's something... Ninja's Hideout. I think in the other game it was literally just called uh, Small, Small World or something like that, or Hostage World. Oh boy, I'm gonna hit speed up real quick. Okay, there we go. That would have taken all day. Now we're getting to the point of the game where group effects are actually kind of the way to go. When you have a weapon, it's be it's it's a pretty good idea to bring something at least one everybody at least most of your team with an AoE ability. <laughs> and the only problem is that uh, everybody AoE, you know, like the big basically not a group effect and a, a, a everybody effect is really hard to do. Yeah, this is a DS game. Uh, I actually, I actually, get, I'll send the link over in the, in the Discord chat. Let me just grab it here. <laughs> it's a really fun game. I highly recommend it. It's one of my favorites. That's why I'm let's playing it. Actually, let me just drop the link in the Discord chat. Wait one second. If you do play it on the me Mesame. I shall. Oh, sorry, that's nothing. You should have seen the robot doing kung fu. He was that was funny. What do we got today? Oh, no, just the heel. The robot doing kung fu was absolutely hilarious. This is. Oh, let me just send it to Hawk because I, I posted this thing in the chat so many times. Uh, let me see here. Do, 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 do. Huh, I don't see Hawk in here. Oh, there he is. It's getting ridiculous now. Oh well, time to chainsaw the fairy. <laughs> I really should give my, give my main character a AOE weapon. And that's probably not going to do it. Oh, no, that, it actually could. If Altain was here, he'd probably be yelling at me for, for chainsawing the fairy. Oh, the, oh, she got her revenge.
Yep. The fairy had her revenge on my main character. But she didn't count on a, on a 54, a 34 Magnum. <laughs> Damn, I'm trying to get that tree to actually turn to something else. Okay, there we go. Oh, that was another bone downside that the, the robot got in this version of the game. He got he he has a he, he's harder to heal now in this game, which makes sense. Yeah, that our poor Medusa. Oh, we got a change. We have a baby dragon who can now breathe thunder and fire. Okay, I'll need to use that point. I'm, it's still pretty early for me. Yeah, there is no dungeon or anything right here. It is literally just a battle. And once again, I'm going to say it. I said it yes last time we played. Poor Lynn. I forget what Angel Wings is. Oh, it's teleport, so we get we can teleport sooner now. Originally, teleport didn't come till way later in the game. Uh, in Legend Two, the father didn't just do a smoke bomb and vanish like that. He actually exploded. Like, there was actually an explosion on screen. The ninja died. It wasn't just a foof, and they're gone. <laughs> and you really thought that, the, that your father had, had, had uh, sacrificed himself. Lynn is really cute. I just feel kind of bad that she gets kind of the short end of the stick in, the, in these games just because she has no good equipment on her. No, it, it's not American censorship. This is a Japanese game because this is this was never translated for America. The original American translation, there was a gigantic explosion. Back to Brian solves his problems with a chainsaw. There we go. Chainsaw for the win. I explained in, in the original game, in Final Fantasy Legend 1, 
every there was due to a glitch you could use a chainsaw on, on literally every enemy in the game. It's not that case in this game. The chainsaw in this game is completely 100 percent the the death ability. So it's just if enemy ha is strong to death, they're not affected by this ability. Excuse me. Yeah, it's because of the chainsaw. He's not a real boss, though. The bosses of this game are the, are the gods, quote unquote. And remember how I said the whole thing of. You, your your thing that detect your your ability to detect relics in a world is tied to that, and it'll tell you how many are there. It does not tell you about all the relics that are quote unquote hidden away by other people. It, it's just it's the number of relics you can you, that you can physically collect. I forget what the mini, mini map extension is of this one. I think it just lets you t tell where the uh, healing spots are. Since now we have a good spot to to um to grab some MP, let me go ahead and grab the let me go ahead and grab the stuff for the the muses that we have to go visit here. I also think that the chainsaw is based on the strength set, so if you have a, a character that has a high strength, it will actually work more often, unless the enemy is resistant to, to uh, death. Alright, what was it again I had? I need to go to Uterra's. I think it's this one. Alright, I'm going to do a quick save state here, just in case I gave her the wrong gift. Yep. Okay, that's hers. And the other one, I believe, is for the insect goddess. Or insect muse, I mean. <laughs> Once again, I'll do a save state just to make sure. And let's see if she'll help us. Nope, cannot yet. Alright, so let's visit Mel and Polly. Okay, Mel is helping us already. Polly is... She's already helping us. Let's try Repsira. Nope, she is not our friend yet. Check on our Arado. Okay, nope, nothing yet. And we already know that I already know that Calliope is helping us, so we can head on back. All right, now I have to remember if there's any other side quests that pop up here. Okay, I do not think so. So we'll head. We'll just go ahead and continue on to. We'll head to the north. As I, I could have. I don't know. I don't know why. I guess could have sworn another quest opens in the north. I remember going through the. I remember going through the uh, the cavern in the north twice. Like there was something up there. Let me just take a quick peek over here. 
but also it could be because of my uh, relationship with my with my team because if that's incorrect you don't get certain quests to pop up at all okay so there wasn't anything there so let's just skip it let's go back and see if our mermaid friend is still uh, away or if she's ready to come with us It's taken her so long to actually join us. The mermaid usually doesn't take this long. There she is. Let's see what she says. I want to say all I have to do is just buy something. But, man, let's just try it out. Nope, not that. Let's just do a high potion. Let's see here if I can figure out how to get her to come with me. No? Hmm. I'm doing something wrong. Oh, there it goes. Because we're done with we have too many heals already let's go find miss leo and i guess i can go give shen long another try but i'm kind of nervous oh yeah <laughs> good point she thinks she'll she'll eat some random meat they'll turn into a tree yeah that was, poor poor thing okay let's see where she's at Okay, there she is over there. In hindsight, that probably was a bad idea to cast thunder while under cast a thunder spell while being underneath the water. Oh well. That's actually just a giant eye. So now, now Leo. Oh, she was a mermaid. She actually was a human. I just watched all her feet. Alright, let's go do something stupid, and let's go try fighting Shen Long again. Save real quick. Let's do something stupid. <laughs> Yeah. You have to defeat him to stand a chance. Yeah. 
Please show me you get that. Mm -mm. I am, however, this time I am not doing something stupid and and, use, and trying the chainsaw Let's on him. Defeat Shang Long to stand a chance. Ryu, Street Fighter 2. Yeah, I wouldn't know that. I'm sorry. Yeah, I can, okay, I can actually take the hit this time. Okay, he's actually taking... Okay, he's immune to all of Ill elements, and he has high high evasion, so I'm gonna have to come back here later and fight him again. Or I could just take his magical shoes and run, but that's okay. Oh, that's right, we can just teleport out of here. Alright, let's just go ahead and exit here. He's back to being a super dragon. He was a Medusa. He got encased in wood, became a treant or a sequoia treant, and now it's back to a uh, dragon. And I and I chainsawed a fairy, and you missed it. <laughs> I told the chat that Altane would be very unhappy with me if I chainsawed the fairy again. Fairy murderer. <laughs> fairy murderer. So what are we doing for breathing down here? I don't know. <laughs> yeah, uh, for some reason in the game, they just said that anybody who walks into that ocean can breathe underwater. They just said it was a thing. Like when they were, when they were talking like the, a man who fell in love with a mermaid just walked into the sea and didn't come back. And he just breathed underwater. It was just really odd. Then the fairy killed him. <laughs> Okay, I didn't have a Durandal in my in my group, in my monster book, so that's nice. Said the fairy killed him. The fairy killed him. Oh, yeah. You, you know, you, the guy who walked into the sea probably met a fate with Shenlong the dragon, and that was it. You have to defeat him to stand a chance. Yep. I see. All right, I think I could probably get started with a little bit of, of the next world since it is, that was very short. I'll just go ahead and speed through this because we've been through this freaking ten times already. Oh, I now can I can now visit Clotho. I think to reset reset my connections. No, that's okay. Yeah, no offense, but she's one of the most useless ones I find. Alright, now we'll just head out and on to the next world. Well, I didn't Swords play. Much younger than you, and probably hasn't played the original Street Fighter Two. I know. Oh, I went the wrong. I went. I went the wrong way on accident. So next world is Venus's Megalopolis. This is the right way to go. Okay, we don't have to go visit the goddesses again. We'll just go ahead and hop down to Ven I If this isn't Venus's world, I'm going to I'm going to apologize. I am pretty sure it is, though. Yep, this is it. Choose your fire. Uh, 
Oh boy. And now, and now the other part of this place is navigating this this whole city because it's huge. Let's you know, let's actually use the correct escalator. It's also a lot harder to navigate this place when in when you, when you're in th when you're looking at 3D. I forget where I'm going. Okay, that's that's the cathedral. I think we have to get a blessing from her first. Couldn't tell. There's a tail right there. I'm sorry. That was a ribbon. See? Tail. Fur. Which means that because yeah. the moon firefare is coming back, I can get that for my kitty. Alright, so now that we have permission to walk around this world, they'll actually let us outside the gate, I think. There are several there are two shops here, one high and one low. Yes, Hawk, you heard a kitty in a swimsuit. You can talk to you can talk to uh Jupe about said kitty in said sim swimsuit. <laughs> Yes, talk to the talking sword, strange lady, who we never seen before. If she doesn't shut up, you can just pommel her. Yep. I don't feel like going back around and finding the right way to go. So which one is Hawkin to... He's on Discord, I believe. Oh yeah, they did... Oh, hold on a sec, I got a phone call real quick. Hello? Sorry, that was just our internet company confirming tomorrow as the as the uh, for our appointment. Huh, that's funny. I guess one the gate was in the south in the city, but oh well. Let's head back in. We have to, let's do be the fair shopping first. And finding any other quests and such that are lying around. Yeah, uh, now, oh yeah, I got my, my, my group back to being in, being friendly with each other again, so. How, Let's fix how that. How long before Phoenix ruins it all? I don't get it, but okay. Alright, let's see what we got here. And yeah, we can skip this. And this is the other other uh, weapon shop. Flamethrower. 
forget if it was any good. Ah, oh, yes, the flying knee kick. Let's check on something. Looking for my gear, see what I have on me. Yeah, let's pick up. The, let's pick up the. Yeah, let's do the flying knee kick. I'll give that to Lindsay as soon as as soon as, she, as, soon as her counter run her uh, triple crush runs out. I know we don't really need the end, but I'll just hit it anyway. How helpful of you! Thank you. I could have sworn that the that that person said about the uh, if you didn't drink and if you didn't drink too much, you can you'll find more stuff in the sewer or something. I can't remember off the top of my head. All right, I'm just gonna check the other the other item shop, and then we'll be out of the gate here, and we'll go ahead and go visit Anthony's town. Oh, biker helmet. I forgot what that one that was called in the other game. Actually, I might go upgrade my my shield. But, yeah, let's go ahead and do biker helmet or armored vest. Hmm. Do biker helmet. Okay, the robot's actually pretty good on armor, so I'm gonna go ahead and give it to Lindsay instead. That should be good for right now. Oh, wrong exit entrance. I want the other one. Close enough. Are you drunk? Yes, I am. No, I'm not actually drunk. I don't drink. Uh, hold on a second. My phone call. Hello? Stupid co- stupid co-worker butt dialed me again. Oh, accidentally hit teleport. I was to hit the excavate. That wasn't even worth digging up. After I hit this town, what I'm going to do is I'm going to drop back to hometown to see if one of those side quests has opened up. There are a couple of side quests that open up back at the first area. Just go ahead and excavate here. Okay, no, apparently I can't go back there, so... Yeah, why not? I'll just drop back there real quick. 
Eh, we'll, we'll check it later. Yeah, good thing I hung around. That apparently, that, that's some, That's I think an item that I have to give to somebody at our hometown, or someone you know, basically the teacher. I forget if there was actually anything in these houses or not. Or if they were just literally there just because. Yeah, that's it. Let's throw on the excavate. I forget if he said it was south or north. Yep, there it is. Moonlight nectar. Wait, that's not a. That's not what I think it is. That's that's another gift for, for a muse. to the north. I do know that there are things that require you to go back to your the home the hometown area. No, nope, wasn't that either. Like, it's called, like, junk or something. It really, it's, and you have to bring it back there. Or it's some kind of a stone. And you have to show it to your teacher. Well, time to chainsaw the fairy. No, just kidding. I'm not going to chainsaw the fairy. I'm going to throw a grenade at her. <laughs> I'm just waiting for Altane to get... <laughs> He has no words. You're already hated amongst fairy kind. Yep, now we can eat it because because the monster is currently out. But Repsira loves it. Frickin' Frickin' sadist. Masochist. Repsira is a centaur lady. When she likes seeing people get in, in pain. Black Rose preserves. That's gotta be for Repsira. No? Made from black rose petals soaked, soaked, soaked in sugar. I want to say the insect lady, but I'm not sure. Oh well. Oh, how's our inventory? Because I think the sewers have has, has a good bit of items. Eh. I can always throw out a heal potion if I need to. 
I'm about to use up one of my uh, one of my items on my main character, so a sadist. Thank you. Yeah, Repsira is a sadist. Oh yeah, she loves seeing others in pain. She even says, pain is a beautiful thing. Agility source. Well, that's being used right away. Damn that Thurian. Not only is he a fairy killer, he decides to be greedy with all the sources. Well, actually, Lindsay doesn't need it. Yeah, the the combo things are bought, are purchased from from the goddesses from Clotho. Uh, the, I mean, um, Latrobos. The, the chainsaw. I the chainsaw was a special thing. No, it's not a special thing. It's a regular purchase item. And she's still got forty one use of that triple lunge. I suppose it does. So, so apparently, Sturm and Drang is just literally spinning, spinning around, and, and hitting your body against somebody. From what it looks like. Also, the Magnum should have been uh, was one of those lucky drops from the nit from that ninja psycho sword. Oh, right! I better put this on. Why is there a crab here? Oh, a hermit crab! Hi. I'm gonna at least give him a chance. I'm actually not gonna use a chainsaw on him yet. Oh, he hits pretty hard though, so I probably should. A freaking boss from it, Brad. It's probably the one that Gluco could be friended. He is no the hermit crab was no match. Where is my high potion? Use that up. It's for the mermaid. Gotta give it to her. Yeah, but the foam would like suck up all the water. Don't look at me. <laughs> the hermit crab is the boss of the dungeon. Uh pretty much, I would say. I'm going to head and fast forward through this since it's going to take a while. I'm going to... I'm going to... by far the worst music I have ever heard to speed up. I want to just use up the... Try, there we go. Oh, God. Sorry, Jacob. Hey, a fairy! Look, a fairy I'm not going to kill with a chainsaw. <laughs> Way to go, how long till she dies anyway because of your, your faults. Uh, 
the fairies are actually very good. I find this game, although they get better when they get when you get the higher versions of them, because she starts with stone, thunder, and heal. And it's heal is good because it's an AOE heal that you don't have to freaking go out your way for. No, I'm not. No, Hawk, I'm not going to change to the fairy. I promise, I'm not going to change to that fairy. He will anyway. Don't listen to him. <laughs> Don't listen. All right, let's to go ahead and fast lies. forward. triple one so I can use it up. There we go. Oh, inventory full. Crap. Let's go throw out that punch I don't need. And use up the other high potion. There, I was nice. I healed the fairy, okay? <laughs> no, I'm not gonna prepare for a murder issuing her later. Hawk, is, Hawk, are you cheering on the fairy murderer? Or are you? <laughs> See, you've even corrupted poor Hawk. All right, this this trap, this one is disarmed. Trying to gain the fairy's trust by disarming a trap meant for her. <laughs> what they don't know is that you said it in the first place. Hawk is asking if the music is messing with your head yet, Jacob. <laughs> Only messes with my head when you go up to 20 times speed on it. Relic Holy Amulet. Magma Shield. That lets me walk on fire now. <laughs> Which, that's, that part's already done in the game, so you I'm not... You don't use a Magma Shield. You just throw the fairy on the ground and walk on her. I'm not walking on the fairy. I, I think we confuse Hawk at this point. <laughs> And this should, yep, petrify the frogs. All right, I'll try to speed it up a little bit. Alright, there we go. Now we're in a reasonable range of battle here. <laughs> Mubayoshi. Uh, do we want the fairy to turn into a dragon? Nah. We were fine with the fairy as is. Yeah, I keep on thinking of the Thunderbird from Zelda 2 also. 
despite being named Thunderbird and you have to use Thunderbird, like, like Swerve just said. Somebody get the fairy a security blanket and some cookies. <laughs> I am highly amused by the chat today. Which, uh, which chat? Oh, that's you YouTube. It's a YouTube chat. Yeah, the, fa the fairy is a very good healer. Let's see what we got today. Evil Slice. What's behind this door? Another hermit crab? Nope. Yeah, there was a lot of relics in this sewer. <laughs> I think it's... I think one... I, th I could have sworn one of these is trapped. There, this one is. It still says on YouTube that it's the Jackbox stream. Uh, let me go check. It shouldn't say on YouTube it's Jackbox stream. No? Oh, yeah, my bad. That's weird. I mean, I swore I copied-pasted it. Uh, let me just set it back up. Hold on one second. Do, do, do. And the turn five. There we go. There we go. Fix it. Um, I apologize about that. Thank you, Jupe. Yeah, I don't know why there were so many relics in this sewer. There's been, like, more relics in, in here than any other part of the game so far. Alright, we'll just speed up a little bit so we can... Using up Lindsay's triple lunge is kind of a pain in the ass. <laughs> Sewer lurch doors. Yeah, they're they're just karate guys. They're probably the least threatening people in the game because the way that the that the uh, that the that the uh, taijutsu works on this game, it works on remaining uses left of the item of the of the attack. That's how it that's how it works. So the problem is is that any enemy automatically has their taiju their abilities at full power, so they don't so it's not so it's just low damage. Period. However, if the, if they were to let's say hit you 90 times, yeah, the 90th time would would probably own you. Well, no, not 90 times, but, you know, something like that. That's one fast fairy, if she can outdo my other, my rest of my, my team. Another triple lunge. Well, let's use some crap here, because I don't really don't need... Because triple lunges are at least worth some money. Well, I'll throw out the eye drops, since I don't really don't need those. I remember why, Now I remember why this is a long world. I remember the exact reason why. 
there's another dungeon that's gonna that pops up in here. I disremembered it. All right, since so there's a lot of enemies here, gotta freaking speed through this. There we go. So there's three three knights are guarding. I keep on forgetting. I gave my robot a fire crystal so he would take less damage from fire, for just for Ashra, and I left it on the whole time, and it's been so useful so far. The grand, I don't think the robots were doing that much damage with, with their fire attack anyway. Really? I have no hatred of fairies. I just... That one... Those evil... Those were evil fairies back there. I, I swear they were evil fairies. I don't think I use up all my, all my, all of my uh, threads of fate yet. Let me check out the stream power is going here. Yep, no problem so far. Okay, I didn't use them all up. There we go. So death blow becomes severing slash or severing flash. Check on my inventory. I think I'm full on items again. Nope, I have one slot left. Lunge is worth 6,000, so yeah, let's see what's in this box first. You heard that? Nava said they only wanted to give you muffins. <laughs> that is extremely cruel. No, I am not chainsawing the fairies right now, don't worry. Very in trouble. Don't worry, the chainsaw to the rescue. <laughs> I told you, I solved my problems with the chainsaw. I, sh I am not turning the fairy into a tree. See, I'm being nice to the fairy. Yeah, so that she won't expect it when the real thing comes around. <laughs> oh, actually, Hawk, yeah, yeah, it's been a combination of uh, that and also Jupe's uh, 
keeps on saying I hate fairies for some reason, even though I love fairies. This is a large group. Let to speed up again a little bit. Evil slice. Now let's let this the hopefully the fairy gets enough uh, living armor. Says, "Don't worry, we can win, we can win with Voltron on our side." <laughs> well, so they think. Uh oh, now we're down. We're down. We're getting very low in girls now. There we go. Strike handling skill increased. There we go. Giant helmet, but inventory is full. Yeah, only problem I have with this part of the game, I usually get overloaded on stuff. So let's start tossing out some triple lunges, because I have tons of those things. Well, I'll give that helmet to Lindsay. even though it's the exact same defense. Oh well. And I'll give the giant, the biker helmet to the robot. And I'll just toss the gloves. They're cheap. Hey, at least this game it doesn't go Thundaga Thundara. It does. It goes to Hell Thunder, which admittedly sounds pretty cool. I know. I I know who Nana Hoshi is. Hey, I love fairies. Despite what what Juke tries to to put in the chat, do I want to? So Jake, <laughs> here it is, right here, as you were saying, where I kill the fairy and she becomes a ghost. <laughs> No, I'm not going to do that. <laughs> I am not going to kill the fairy and make her into an apparition. <laughs> I am not that cruel to the fairy. Skip it just a little bit. Mm 
Oh shit, that was a trap. Oh well. I'm going to switch out my threads real quick. Let's try like this. I'll try to skip a little bit of the enemies here. And we're out. Yeah, you can't actually go in that way, you have to go the other way. So it's a one-way exit. Because you can choose the when you start the game, you actually you you pick your you make your own team. Give me a second here. I'll I'll do a quick save slot. All right, and just when the save slot, I'm going to save twice just in case I accidentally hit the wrong button here. What I'm going to do is I'm going to hit reset. Since I showed this in the first episode, but I'll show you guys real quick since you since I I know you guys weren't here for that. I'll just go ahead and do a new game regular. All right, so you have your your four human guys, each with different color schemes and such. One of which looks like a human girl. Yeah. What? This one? Yeah. Yeah. Your human females. Your the mutant slash espers, which are all shirtless men for some oddball reason. Your as for females, which are all elfies, and that thing, which is an abomination, I still say because that hair is like, ugh. It's like a, it looks like an ice cream cone shat on her head. Uh, it's the, what I said about Summoner's War, where I was getting tired of seeing ice cream cone hair. You have your robots, and you have your monster. The monsters, it's your choice if you want to bring them along. They're just they they just they evolve and they can be. Think of them like the enemies that you can you can grab from. Um, Espers are mutants from Legend Two. When you play Final Fantasy Legend Two, and uh, hello Ariana, I'm I I've been playing this for a while. I just wanted to stop for a second to show the other people who were just coming in about the, cre the character creation. So yeah, in the original game, this actually was a. This actually was a. Uh, they, the espers were called mutants because mutants were a hi hybrid of monster and human. They could adapt monster abilities, and that's why they have. That's why they actually have uh, the, the, those 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 magic spells. All right, I'm gonna head and load back up the game we were just at. And you could bring whatever team you want. I just don't recommend bringing four robots, four monsters, or a combination thereof. Always at least have have at least one human mutant or whatever just to go along with you. And here comes the earthquake. Yeah, the robots are they they trade off having a uh, breakable equipment because they they fuse the parts to them, but the, their weapon use is dropped by half, and whatever they equip becomes their stats. Monsters, on their hand, they can't equip any weapons at all, but they their stats are based on what monster they are. That's it. That's literally it for them. Oh, you know, I just thought of something. Since my fairy is not is currently a magic user, I'm going to give her a magical crystal, a lightning one. That way she'll be able, able to at least survive taking a lightning blast. And let's go ahead and sell some junk. 
yeah, this game is a lot of fun. I highly recommend playing it, at least this version of it, if you haven't if you haven't played uh, Legend yet. Even if you play Legend, this is a great playthrough. And I've been telling people, even Swerve, and I don't know if I told Swerve, I would love to actually have a have a run of this game where we do a where I can load like figure out a way to do a multiplayer one so I can do a co op a co op mission or a co op boss battle. Just to see how it would look. Okay, so I don't want triple lunges. Let's throw the nugget. That should be good for right now. Probably don't need that mithril bow. I'm not going to be using it. Alright. I love the fairy. I really do. I'm not li I wasn't lying. It's just that whenever it comes up where I have to battle a fairy, Altain just says something like fairy killer or something. He'll just he'll just mutter on the side and I'll be like, What? <laughs> that's how, so that's why that happens. Because it's funny. Because it's for comedy purposes only. So do weapon shot number two, I think. Oh, yeah, here we go. This is a flamethrower? No, the other one did. Okay, never mind. Alright, let me go ahead and... Yeah, it was the other one I wanted to go to. Since I have a lot of money now, I'm going to upgrade my stuff. Because I want a flamethrower. And let's grab a flame sword. I haven't really haven't used that thing, have I? Oh well. Okay, flame sword. I'm keeping the chainsaw. And I guess I get that get that whip. Robot, though. I kind of want to switch out the sh uh, no, the shock whip. I'm thinking, eh, yeah, shock whip for flamethrower. I'm thinking. I'll just sell off the rest of the junk. I don't need. I'm not gonna use like the sword. I'll keep the shock whip for later. Self mithril sword. I'll keep that lightsaber still. There we go. And I'm gonna start Lindsay on the on the uh, on the triple on the flying knee kick. All right. And one other thing I want to do first is I want to just take a quick teleport. Yeah, the relationships in the menu actually determine the subquests that pop up and the conversations within those subquests that pop up. It's fairly interesting. I actually like how they how they did it in this game. All right, let's see if it actually is a quest here or if it's just nope, nothing. Okay, so there wasn't any other thing there. Okay, uh, let's see. We are doing pretty good. I can go ahead and I can finish Venus's city, or we can, or we can switch to Jackbox. What do you guys want to do? I'm just taking a quick teleport around, seeing if there's anything. Oh, there is something here. Just give me a second. Hey Brian, this fish has this fish has no eyes. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, if you guys want to do some Jackbox tonight before the internet goes crazy, I don't mind. Here's the sub-quest I needed. Yep.
Yes, the Pantheon and Earth are from our, are my dictionary and a couple other ones that you needed that weren't weren't told. Let me turn into a big woman in a heartbeat. Yes, I actually have. So which kid is that? The sick fetishist? He's the one that likes monster meat. Don't look at me. See this worth. Oh, while I'm here, let me go ahead and recharge my stuff. I also should drop off this stuff to the to the girls at the at the muses, I mean. Okay, so, oh, what's this? Urania the baby. I, that's right, I remember. As you fight, you'll eventually find Urania just pop up and it help you. And you have to make sure that... I don't remember what happens. I really don't remember. Someone's on Angel and Asgard's North Town. Yeah, I've been selling the equipment. I'm not sure how, how uh, up up with uh, the stream you are at the moment. Okay, you are the foam tiara, and just to make sure, I'm doing a save slot. Very good. Too bad. That girl likes sand. So she's in the desert north of North Town, roughly. Okay. Let me just real quick here. Nope. Okay, it is that that is for it has to be for the other for, for Espera. Yeah, if you're not the if you're not the Moonlight Nectar, I don't know what you are. Nope, it's not, huh? Are you Moonlight Nectar? Yep. Okay, well, that's at least saved me a trip from talking, having to talk with me. Oh, hold on, the bug lady wants to help me now. Oh. That means the star one has to be for Polly. Urania is so fluffy. So she's a fat baby. Don't look at me. The only time you ever even see her is when she's in a in a in a uh, in, in a rocking chair or a carriage or something. Wow, nice to see you care, Respira. <laughs> the girl isn't around, I don't care. I, I'm 
I'm sympathizing with her. Ah, Das is good. Who's that one? That's Respira. I just told you. She's the she's a sadist. She's she's also a centaur. I can play it. And she she so that's why you like her because she's not only a centaur, she also hates Urania. Yep. Awesome. Uh, actually, Hawk, I have I have normal delay on, so that means it's probably about thirty seconds. Let's say. Let's head to North Town. Actually, let's head to head to the South Forest real quick. I'm only trying to avoid the fights here because they're just going to be a waste of time, honestly. But I have not much choice, looks like, in this matter. Yes, I'm sorry. Thank you, Hawk. She's in a cradle. My mistake. Yeah, Clematis hair ornament. I think that's Arado. It's not in a very bad spot, if I remember correctly. It's... I forget where it's at, though. Alright. Kind of speed through here. Hey, long I got a, I got a defense boost. That's nice. There it is.
Oh, yeah, they probably should have thrown someone a little higher in the in the game at us, I think. This, this is a little little weak. Yep, I've been rolling around at the speed of sound. What does a fairy turn into? Uh Well, I'm gonna hit the button because it's not let, it's not showing me what I what it is. So I probably according to this, I don't actually have this in my monster dictionary. A worm. It says it's not in my dictionary, but at the same time, I really think the fairy's cute. Uh, I'm gonna pass on it. No, no, no. I'm a completionist. I'm gonna go. I'll, I'll get the fairy back later. Hey, it inhaled it in the worm inherited heal inherited heal, so that's not so bad. So I got a meteor fragment. And is this an, if this is an event item, I think I bring it back to the teacher. Yep. So let's teleport back to Outset Town. Oh, that guy is still here. No, oh, yeah, he's still here. All right, let's bring the meteor back here. What can kill, what can also heal. Yeah, the worm survived the, the, <laughs> the surviving turn into a to a whatever, and so now it's it, it's gonna help us and heal. So now let's head over to the next. Wait, did I just see something pop up here, or is that just my eyes playing? Yep. Okay. Let's head over to Desert Town for a second. Hey Brian, I was gonna make it the flyers, but I'm gonna make it after all. All right. Let's go ahead and get a nice, get a nice group of P enemies here. And let's see that if that summons Urania. Alright, so let's see here. There's the bird. There's a slime. There's a spider. One, two, three. I don't want this enough to summon her. There it is. That's Urania. It's a flying baby carriage. I think I have to do it a couple times. Let me just see if I can pull some enemies together here. I'll do that one group of three over here again since they're they're decently easy to get. No, just two at a time. Oh well. There's Rainy again. Alright, let's see if that actually... No, I'll do it again. Alright, so I probably can do it at least with just two, it looks like. 
I'm hoping I'll have to do one in each world. But knowing my luck, it probably is. Well, let's try it. There's Rainy again. There we go. Whoopee. Woo! Whoopee! Whoopee! Whoopee. Whoopee. Uh. Babies. Who needs them? <laughs> Paid for with extra news points that they didn't found under his sash of uh, cat girl magazines. Alright, let's go finish it off. Where the heck's the teleporter to, to, fair, to Muse land? There it is. Yeah, I have no idea. I don't remember there being a black hole behind Urania. Be a partner. Oh no, that's right. You can exchange uranium. I think you can. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Yeah, you're gonna make uranium up one of your members of your team, and I'm like, eh. It's another sword arm, unfortunately. But I'm going to try one other stupid thing since I'm about to take a. I, I want to see about switching the jackbox. Oh, no, there is no other... Oh, no, there it is. Alright, let's go ahead and challenge the Arena of the, arena of the Dead. Alright, let's go after... Let's go after Ashra's soul. Uh, let's go after. Dang it. Yeah, let's go after Ashra's soul. Oh, I'm trying to figure out. I'm trying to do the one player version of this. Oh, it's a mistake. It's, it's, it's supposed to be one. How many players are going to play? So I'm going to have four players. So I want one player to play this one. I forget if Ashra's soul is a pain in the ass one or not. He wasn't that. He he didn't do that much damage.
Okay, it wasn't so, so bad. Yeah. Yeah, Osher just has a lot of defense, a lot of HP, I think. Oh, and apparently he uses his arms. That's not good. Hellblaze. Sleep L. Hellblaze again. I can still pull this one off. Pulled it off. Let's see what item I got from it. Hater of all this time. I'll give you a present of a silencer. Well, the silencer at least isn't too bad because that's an item I can sell. Also, anything I did in that in that thing gets restored, so. So let's see. I, think I can fight the next one. I can fight Dune I can fight Dune Dune Test Reborn. to the head. Exactly. I think this is the first boss I ever defeated in the arena. Oh no, not again. We're back to the freaking chainsaw doing the test again. Freaking war! I should get the ferry. Can you, not revive? you can't revive in this game. Yeah, I don't think I'll be doing this battle until I get at least a better monster. Yeah, death, death, everybody, death to my whole team. There is an anti-death armor that you get later on. Chainsaw, yeah, chainsaw him. This guy is, yeah, this guy. Dumatis were born, or Dumatis' soul is armed with chainsaw him. I agree. Yeah, no way. At least there's no penalty for losing. Uh, let's not let's not try another one of those. Let's go ahead and get out of here. Oh. All right, uh, it's seven thirty. I can st I can keep going with this, or we can I can switch over to do some Jackbox. You guys want to play some Jackbox? Yeah, I'm not. I'm not too concerned about it. There's actually uh, two air, two arenas. One's a one-player one, and that one that is an end game only one. I don't think it opens until I actually beat the final boss. Okay, I'll keep going with it. I'll go ahead and finish Venus's world. Okay. Yeah, I'll keep going until the. Uh, until the internet decides to go stupid.
Okay, so next, when we left off. Yeah, we got, um, uh, Hawk is actually enjoying the game, so. The other nice thing is that even if the internet starts going stupid a little bit, because of the, because I have it set to normal latency, it won't be, like, a huge error. It'll only give, like, eh, every once in a while, you, like, very, very little error. It's a lot better. Okay, I don't need a sewer key anymore. And I'll save that for my next trip, my next trip in. The silencer I'll just sell, and the rest of it's fine, I guess. Probably one trick to going in there is probably get, probably giving everybody a, a an item that's uh, one of the taijutsus that has like maybe two uses on it left. Oh, it this is amazing, Hawk. I, I'm, I highly recommend giving this a shot yourself. I really do. It's a lot of fun. It's just, and I'll be honest, I actually play this on my phone. <laughs> I actually downloaded the, uh, which which one was it? The, uh, oh, what the heck is I, I actually I actually purchased one of the 3DS emulators, and it this game is beautiful on it. It, it, it actually looks better on the on my phone than it does on here. Drastic. I used a thing called Drastic. Let me see if I can find the picture I was showing the other day. Yeah, here we go. Yeah, I actually... It actually, I find the, the way that they did it, the edge, they did they have an, a special edge around all of the uh, 3D models on the Drastic version of the, game, of the uh, emulator. And the even cooler part is... Is that you can actually take the save files from your from your drastic from the Game Boy and the uh, computer version? It, it it actually works. The save files will will coincide with it, so you can actually can transfer your save over and keep, and keep playing. So it's it's actually pretty cool. Now, if you do want to try playing it though, I have a one in very important thing to, to give you. I have to send over a, a little a, a how to set your sound on your on your emulator. That, that's and that's it really. Let me see if I can find the button for it here. I think I cropped it. OneDrive pictures. Yeah, so I gotta find where it's at here. Not that. Found it. Okay, I gotta just crop this real quick. Edit. Crop. No, not rotate. I just need a crop. Oops. One second. This thing out of the way won't let me. There we go. Okay, so basically... If you do it, you have to set these settings. I'll, I'll say if you if you are interested, I'll send it over on uh, on uh, on on. <clears throat> excuse me, I'll send it over on Discord. Okay, let me go ahead and sell my the stuff I need and want. And get rid of that shock whip. Oh, that long sword too. There we go. Perfect. Yeah, let's upgrade to a, let's upgrade our mithril shield to a fire shield. And let's just quickly organize our stuff. There we go. Yeah, I'll need what, another submachine gun. There we go. Probably, that'll be enough. Oop, let me go ahead and leave this again. Oh, I have to go the other the other way. Yeah, uh, check your uh, hawk. Check check Discord when you load it up.
Yeah, if you load up Discord, you'll see I sent you the I sent you the link. And I'm gonna send you the JPEG also of the settings for the game for the sound. No problem. All right, off we go to the off we go to the vault to, to the volcano. Hey ho, volcano. Huh, that was in the south over here. I could have sworn it was. They must have moved it for this game. Yeah, I remember it being in the southwest of Venus's city. This one's in the northwest. I forget if our if our magma shield is a uh, thing or oh yeah, we have to actually equip it. Chest sensor, yep, there we go. Who's coming to help? Polly is. I agree. Can you still kill the creator with that, that thing in this? Creator uh, isn't in this game. Creator is in the creator is in the first uh, the first saga game. And that was an actually the funny thing was I actually watched somebody doing a yeah I could probably change all the dinosaur. Uh, some I watched somebody doing a speed run. He chainsawed all four of the five, all four of the gods. He chainsawed no, no wait no he couldn't do Genbu because Genbu didn't have a chainsaw at the time. He chainsawed Seryu. He chainsawed Byako. He chainsawed Suzaku and the Ashura and the Creator. I find that absolutely hilarious. Still, and our worm is now an ant lion. Who has a lot more each? No, because the chainsaw has a glitch. How the chainsaw is, is calculated is if 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 your strength is your, this is how it's supposed to be calculated. If your strength is higher than the enemy's defense, chainsaw chainsaw instant kill. However, said Final Fantasy Legend One had an error. It it had it it accidentally reversed the greater than less than sign. So it, as long as you had a low strength, the chainsaw would kill whatever it is you you hit automatically, guaranteed, no no if ands or buts. So with the, no the buts yes, buts are great. But so anyway, the and I earned a fl another flamethrower, great. So, but that's how it is. It's. I mean, it's funny. I it, it kind of removes the fun of the game. Life, if you ask, yeah, if you ask me, the Spiegel. Oh yeah, honey is actually a heal in this game. That's right. I should actually kill more of those fish. Okay, that flamethrower was pretty weak. That fish just slapped me with its tail. Twice. Loud slice. Severing flash. 
death. Turns to a golem. Yeah, why not? A golem that can poison people for some oddball reason. Yeah, the golems didn't look that interesting in the other game either, so. Cutthroats and gazers. The rock dude is better because he flashed more in. Yeah. Counters them equal power. Yeah, cutthroats actually can can kill. The rest of the enemies, not so much. Yeah, this might not be good. I might be going seeing I might be going yep, I'm gonna be seeing Odin. Yep, I'm gonna be seeing Odin. Alright, let's try this again. I don't know if that's going to be helpful, but it yeah, actually saved me for a moment there. Let's see if they actually are affected. Thank God. I'm hoping that... Nope, no robot. Shit. I'll stick with the fire shield because that actually was pretty handy. And let's here's hoping for another combo. Yep, here we go. Death. Still can pull this one off. All right, there we go. have her cure as soon as possible. Whew. Come on, attack. Damn it. I need to... I need to... Hold, hold, hold off until I can, until I can get uh, one of those damn guys down. Ugh. Here goes nothing. No, nope. I didn't win this one. I don't think I did unless he can go first. He can, he might be able to. Oh really? Oh, I, I flamethrower sucks. I need to ditch it. All right, I have to, I have to chainsaw three enemies. Can I do it? One. Nope. Destruction beam. Ugh. I'm stuck here. I have to actually get this. Death Sword. I'll try Death Sword. Let's hope for the best. Hope, come on, come on, death. Yes, that was enough to kill them. Thank God. I 
that's not good. <sighs> Come on, Death Sword. Come on, Death Sword. Woohoo! <laughs> Got out of that one. Holy shit. <laughs> oh, that was dangerous. Oh, that was very dangerous. Oh, I was I would, but the trouble was is, I, is that my char my main character was using a shield, which was which was he was tanking the damage. So I got lucky on that one. Holy crap! Oh, and here's a wellspring. Oh well. Oh, yay. <laughs> yeah, I got lucky on that one. Holy crap. My light is, I'm put my light on real quick. Right back. Right. Oh, wait a second. I just realized something. I'm still blinded, I think. I'm trying to get this thing to give me a sass effect back. I don't think it's going to. Oh, well. No biggie. Alright, continuing on. Alright, magma floor. There's no treasure chest, so I can just go right to the next area. There's Antony. Falling along. I don't know how the hell he's falling along, just hiding and stuff. It's playing a freaking pansy. Let's see if the flamethrower actually does damage to to them. The flamethrower maybe maybe it's better on the robot. Maybe them just maybe I'm just having bad luck with it. I forget what game I was I was playing that if if you have a uh, someone's blinded, they they have half evasion also because they can't see you coming. Also, if you're wondering why that Magnum does so much damage, it's it's a um, it's an item I'm supposed to get like three or four worlds from now. I just got lucky on finding it. And what do we got? If yeah, McClay Man too, back to the ferry. Actually, she's a sprite. I think it's. I think that's the correct level fairy. Kind of curious, real quick. Uh, player notes, meet dictionary. Fairy. Yeah, it's sprite's the first one. So sprite, sprite, fairy, nymph, self, Titania. How do you have all the way up to Titania 
uh, New Game Plus. I don't. I don't have. I can't use them. It's just that they're there. You know what I'm talking about. I wonder how. They seem like they're pretty good. Alright, we have a breakable wall. Yay, high potion. Just what I always wanted. Yeah, I have no idea how Anthony is walking on lava without any help whatsoever, but whatever. Whatever does it for you, buddy. You know, the one time I actually could use a set of eye drops. Death's, death sickle. Is that a gift item or is it an actual weapon? It has an actual weapon. Well, I mean, the robot's been using that death sword pretty well, so maybe I should upgrade him to the death sickle. It's an. Wow, it's an actual. It's a special blade, too. Hmm, that's pretty. That's pretty rare. Special blades are the equivalent of speed based weaponry in the game. Hmm. Well, I can. Okay, is Ninto the Nintos uh, katana to death sickle, which I am. The fresh maker. Yeah. Might as well. Right, where is my staircase? Here it is. And wait for Anthony to do something stupid again. It's more like an ice pick. It's purple colored though. Okay, the flamethrower at least does damage to enemies weak to fire. That's nice to know. Flower. Let's trim that one. Hold on a second. Tell Lindsay to go first. Plunder learned. Pillage and plunder. Pillage and plunder. Steals money. At the speed of light. Um, I don't think it's very useful because money is fairly... Money is fairly common. Well, it's easy to get in this game. I don't think you steal for that much. Unless you steal for the amount of your agility. Which you could just buff your speed to hell and back and then go for it. Forgetting what to check the traps. Oh well. Let's see what's. Demolish. Another flame sword. Okay, no complaints there. That one will go to the robot. Oh, actually, I'll give the, this flame sword 
the robot. Because, I mean, I have three extra uses on it, but why not? But, there we go. I'm not going to waste another use on just one, one step there. Magic source. That's one to Lindsay because she's the only magic user I got. I use it on the fairy, but I don't think it does. It work? Nope. Not allowed to use on the fairy. Nope. Can't use on the robot either. It would be kind of nice though, be able to give your your monster a little more power, and it, and it carries over. But eh, oh well. Let me try plunder out and see if it's anywhere near good or if it sucks. Yeah, 150 caro. I could just kill the enemy and get more than get ten times that amount. Yeah, I'll steal from you by killing you. Our buddy Tim actually had a a funny one. We're like, Tim, do crowd control, and he'd and he'd go, I'll do crowd control by killing them. We, oh yeah, Tim was freaking amazing. We, 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 Tim was a <laughs> he was a man. This is a book of no. Is it, oh, it's a staff of sorcery. That's right. I remember that one. I don't know why it's called the Staff of Sorcery. They should just call it like the Blaze Rod or something. Because all it is is just a AoE fire ability. So I have my first AoE attack. Or that hits every enemy, I should say. That's an item. And I forgot my... Equip my other... Excavate. There it is. Shimiji. Well, it's a it's a it's a well, the fairy could turn into something something I don't have in my dictionary. Yeah, let's try it. Let's see how much I'm hated. It's a fish. It's a dork fish. <laughs> it's a dork fish. <laughs> I'm a dork fish. It caught me with a with a piece of meat. The meat from a from a mushroom. That doesn't even make any sense. <laughs> yeah, I was about to say how does. I don't know, but we caught a dork fish. I'm a dork fish. It's just, it was a fairy at one time. I'm a dork fish. Yep. We got a dork fish. Yep. <laughs> Yep, Hawk knows the Hawk knows the dorkfish. All right, magma shield. I wish there was a faster way of setting these abilities because this is a little aggravating. Back to the menu. Switch to act, switch to demolish. Switch back to Magma Shield. I'm not even going to disarm trap at this point. I don't even because I don't why? Partially because I don't care. I just want to keep moving. Another flamethrower. Let's just get out of here. There we go. Switch to excavate. <laughs> oh, 
I wonder if I could just hit Y and then cycle. No, it doesn't let me do that. Well, this is a healing spring coming up. Crown of Thorns. Rep Sarah. The bridge is probably my safer bet. I don't feel like wasting another slot on a uh, on a um, another use on my uh, my map abilities. Yep, you can slice a dinosaur with a chainsaw. Fin fangs or tail? Let's do fangs. Bullet chain. Wow, that was a lot of damage. And we're going to get a sidewinder instead of a fit, dork fish. That's one pissed off snake, man. If it, it's a snake with a list. Yes, it is. If. Let me switch to. Let me make sure I'm not doing something stupid and let me put on disarm trap just in case. Oh yeah, let me throw on the cure tome here. Oh yeah, it has to be equipped with somebody for it to actually do a good heal. Yeah, that's an amazing heal. A world of two. Okay, there's no bomb in this trap, thank God. There's another fire shield. I don't know why that's even there. This is the end of the dungeon, I could have sworn. Yep, there's the relics. Dwarven Magatama. Yoink! So now we have to go stop Anthony from doing something stupid. Let me just check a quick peek here. Where's that dwarf? Jay Ward, the voice of the sealed dwarves can be heard when in the presence of treasure. So there's just more treasure, apparently. I'm guessing it's more treasure. I actually don't remember how it works. Or is it a uh, ramp ability? Oh, it changes the color of the treasure chest on the mini-map based on the chest's contents. Items are yellow. Relics are blue. Traps are red. Well, that's nice to know. And empty chests are gray. That's handy. Alright, let's go stop Anthony from doing something stupid. Oh, what am I doing? I'll just teleport back to town.
I'm getting rid of this damn flamethrower. It looks it looks kind of cool, but maybe it's for a robot. But my robot's already pretty good, so I'm not, I'm not changing him right now. Sleep tone, need the grenades, no flamethrower, no thank you, no stun gun, no thank you. Not that, get rid of that. Other flamethrower gone, and I already got a fire shield, so. Yeah, I don't think I have anything here I really want, so I'll save my money. I'm saving my money for one reason. I know there's a, there's a uh, town coming up, it has some amazing treasure in it. But it's ridiculously expensive. All right, go to the other item shop so I can get some better armor. Okay, let's grab some. I might as well grab the, let me see here, like, what best patch together from the other various collected, I think it's called Army, if I remember correctly. It's called Army in Legend 2. Let's see, Giant's Armor, we'll get that to Lindsay. And I think she already has a giant helmet on. Yeah, he had the biker helmet, so he's good. Yeah, I think we're pretty much set on th on this here. Yeah, I don't think I need anything else here. That's good. Oh, while I'm thinking about it, let me switch my main character's that flamethrower out since I'm not liking it. Alright, time to go crash the party. And before I do that, I'm gonna I'm gonna save because this is a tough this might be a tough battle. Let's switch up our things a little bit here. Save here and let's roll. I will make a comment that the music is usually pretty faithful for the original, but in the original game. It's the opening credits that it, that this music is supposed to be because it sounds more, it, that sounds more like a uh, wedding thing than than the uh, hometown music.
Yeah, listen to the snake, man. That's enough. <laughs> Yeah, she is being married to a demon. That's going from the snake, man. You must. Yeah, that's, that's low. <laughs> yeah, the snake can see up your skirt. You know you're pretty ugly down there. Now, no chainsaws against her, so I'll be a Jedi Knight. Well, no, it doesn't work on everything in this game. There's, I told you, there's, there's it's anti, it, it works as a death thing, so it's anti-death. Temptation, I think it's charm. Yeah. I'm not sure what lens is going to do, but it kind of worries me a little bit. Ah, oh, crap, she's using an Aegis shield. She has the best shield in the game. I have a shield too, but it's not as it's not as powerful as yours. But at least just just in case. I need Lindsay to snap out of it so I can start attacking again. Well, the snake ain't falling for that. Yes. Yeah, uh, Olivia cut herself on purpose so she could be kicked out of the city. Yeah, she's, like a bitch. she's actually not as bitchy in this version. She was a lot worse than the other in the Game Boy version. I felt. Because charm didn't last this long, or she didn't even had the damn thing. No, I'm talking about in action. Oh yeah, in action is definitely. Oh no, no, I have two people who are charmed. You don't have an Asuna. There is no Asuna in this game. Oh, finally you're doing something, and she's immune. Lindsay just hit herself. Great. All right, this time, yeah, immune, great. Yeah, there is no anti-charm in this one. But luckily, only one person uses charm, I think it's her. That's not gonna work! In a fit of rage, my main character has decided to take a chainsaw to Venus, and it did not work. That must be one iron brassier. Brazier, thank you. No, she did the blade grasp, but with her breasts. Oh, for love of God, come on. Release the charm already. Funeral blaze. Well, the person who was charmed is out. Or one of them, I should say. 
There's the other one. Ah, oh, crap. Now it's up to the snake. Death. Well, that ain't yeah, this isn't gonna work. The charm's not wearing off. Yeah, there was a, there was a better heal. All right, so now I'm gonna try. Let's try it again. No, that was well, that. Americans would have gotten frustrated with that. No, it, you could go back and try it again. That's all. Now it's just bad luck. I mean, Venus is it was a pain in the ass one. Ah, shit, she just used Aegis. Either Flash. Oh, fuck. Here comes the damn charm abilities again. You can't hit yourself. No, you can't hit yourself. I'm starting to see why the saga games didn't go far. What are you talking about? It, it's, just the, it's just one person that does this ability. I mean, once she—the only the main problem is she uses she uses the Aegis Shield and she can't be hit by magic. And she she can she can charm at Pete your party, which like I said it had barely happened in the other one. Oh god, I just I just hit Lin through the I just hit Lin through the chainsaw. <laughs> the fairy with the chainsaw would have been pretty damn funny, I have to admit. Yeah, I'm not going to fight her. I'm going to have to back out for this one. I can tell the, the connection problems are going to be... Oh, yeah, here comes the connection problems now. Yeah, we just started getting a couple of, a couple of frame drops yeah, here. I noticed it when I was gathering on here. I mean, I'm still going to at least push on a little bit so I can try to finish this. I'm, I'm not going to go... F I'm not farming. I just want to at least get... My, I want to get a different uh, monster, at least. And use Ed... Get, get Lindsay's uh, attack down a little bit, or her, her weapon up, down a little bit, so it'll at least... Oops. So it won't be so bad. Down for a second. Just give me a second. Alright, so we'll just have the grenade, the robot do nothing. I guess I'm not gonna farm. I just wanna get, I just wanna get the, uh, Try at least get a different monster that'll, that'll be able to do something. And Jake's probably like, "You crushed it, cut the fairy." Yeah, I probably should have, because at least the fairy would be able to keep healing. Hey. 
at least get this. Alright, I'm, I'm gonna have to have the robot fight, because there's no, no way I'm gonna be able to get these guys out otherwise. Heal. getting up. bit more out here and then I'll head out head in and go take out uh, Venus I might have to wait till tomorrow to go get Venus actually yeah it's it's still working And a fairy can now cure and heal. And she can... Oh yeah, she's learned how to do break. Yeah, fairy has two abilities. She can cure and heal. Heal, though, is all it is is just... Um, yeah, it's just AoE heal. Don't need that. Yeah, I need a. There's a status. There is a status healing one, but I think only Titania gets it. All right. Don't use the grenade. Use a flame sword, and just you heal. Big eyeball, no thank you. Alright, let's start heading back. No, baby, we don't care. Very rest, some of these just might be deadly.
Try to change all the fairy again, Jacob. now. This isn't that good. Now I'm just going to finish him off. Nope, already did. I'm trying. I'm just trying to get Lindsay's uh, her 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 uh, taijutsu a little bit lower. Oh, I know what to do. I'll have fire shield up. How are we doing, Lindsay? Is it uh, kind of low? Flying kick is 31. That's not too bad. I'm gonna do one more just to just to make sure it's let's get a nice even 30. Do nothing. Just actually, we'll go a little bit lower than 30. Hey, the lower it is, the more strong, the stronger it is. So, Lindsay's gonna be the P Lindsay's gonna be the PVE, the not PVE. I'm sorry, the the MVP of the battle. Hopefully, if I do this correctly. Otherwise, she's gonna about, about to get charmed, and I'm gonna be getting my own knee, my own ass knee kicked. I vote on the second one. My own ass knee kicked. Oh, I need to heal first. All right, so the chainsaw isn't very helpful against Venus. Let's let's throw a uh, cure tome. Actually, let's throw an elixir on, just in case Lindsay gets charmed. I'm gonna, I'm gonna see if that actually heals status ailments too. Let's let's play a what little. What if he gets charmed and uses the elixir? That would suck. <laughs> All right, we can go ahead and fast forward through the through the uh, wedding thing here. And music has started becoming a cacophony. It's like the town of horrible. It's like a town of horrible music all over again. All right, one more good shot at this.
Now you come help us! Where the hell were you girls earlier? Can you even death the robot? No, you cannot. Oh, great. Now she, her Taijutsu is going to start missing. She was looking at the thunder. I don't know why you used that. I, I didn't know she was using the thunder. She didn't use her ages. She, she didn't use her ages yet. The previous battle, she had, uh, you had, you, one of your people had gotten confused and used thunder. She yeah, she had the ages up, though. All right, so the fairies going to do nothing for a bit. Hi. Now she's helping again. Oh, okay, here we go. Let's see if this... Oh, thank God it missed that time. Why is she missing? Because otherwise you couldn't cast double missed. <laughs> that was stupid. Atomic Archive. Oh, she dropped a nuke bomb. That was the effect of the nuke bomb in the game. That's the animation for it. I don't care. I, I'm having the fairy attack just to get the, get the combo chain going. Oh, poor fairy. All right, let's see if it's... Oh, there we go. I got her. We got Venus's fan. Well, I certainly wasn't Venus. There were fairies making muffins and giving them away to us. You see what Hawk said, Jake? Yeah. Now we have the Aegis shield. The Aegis Shield is cheap. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Burn. Uh, hey guys, you forgot about me. The Muffin Fairies. The funny thing was, I, I believe in Legend 2, she slashed her cheek, not her nose. She slashed her forehead. Well, it? yeah, but if you look where it is, it's right between her eyes. That's like, I guess that counts as the forehead. Alright, I will need to take a break here just because it's... I don't know how the the stream is going to be you guys, but it's starting to go a little wonky. I mean, it's starting to break up a little bit. It's not like horrible breakup, it's just kind of like, eh, breakup. So what I'm going to do is we're going to... I'm going to go ahead and hit the uh, in, and we will continue this one... Will we ever get married, Theridian? What? Oh, 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 oh. Hey, there's Kane. Yeah, the only thing is that our internet's starting to act kind of wonky.
So that's the only real issue I'm having right now. Yeah, it's only well, it's one of the only agility weapons that I can I can actually hit a group of, an AOE target. Just Kornath is it's not really corn. That sounds like you know K O R N or C O R N. I don't know what the, me and the fairy were doing us. I don't know. I don't know. I'll marry. The, I'd marry the fairy. And yeah, I'm gonna have to save up and quit. I think it's it's just not yeah, our internet just gonna start going out at this time of night. Yep. Yeah, it started cutting around at eight twenty. Let me go ahead and save a rat, and we will continue this. Oh, let me just hit the button here. So I would really love to keep going, but it, this internet is not going to cooperate today. All right, go ahead and cut it there.